So for iMovie, okay, to uh, get a new iMovie, what you want to do is you want to click the plus button up in the upper right hand corner. Um, when you click the plus button, you will get a new screen that says movie or trailer. You want to use the movie version. Okay, if you use trailer, it's going to put in effects and things that you don't want. You can always go back and add those effects in in the movie version, but they're going to be there the whole time in the trailer version, and you may not want those there. So click movie, and then several options will come up. You'll be able to choose things like uh, CNN iReport or news. Um, there are also several others. It doesn't really matter which one you choose because all it really changes is the titles. Okay. Um, so it changes the titles. Once you've selected a theme, okay, you can go ahead and hit Create Movie, which is in the upper right-hand corner. When you create that movie, that's when you're going to be able to start putting in videos. Okay. Once you start putting in video, or once you've taped some videos, um, you can go ahead and start putting them in the iMovies. Now, remember that uh, it is very important that you do not delete anyone else's videos. If you delete someone else's videos, they're gone for their videos. You would not want somebody else to delete five or ten minutes worth of your taping, uh, just like you don't want them to delete yours. Be respectful of other people's videos. Please, please, please do not delete them. Okay. Um, to put in a video, all you really have to do is click on that video and drop it in with the little arrow button. It'll drop in. Okay. So you get a new video in there. Now, I'm going to go to somebody's video. Uh, actually, I think I can do this from right here. To put in, or to do some of the editing stuff that you want to do, uh, you can click on the video. It'll come up with the yellow screen. When you've got that yellow uh, box around that video, you're able to shorten and lengthen that video. So you can just click on the yellow, it'll bring you the line there, and then you can make it longer or shorter. Okay? Um, so you can use that video. Uh, or you can make that video as short or as long as you want it. With that video, you can also take the sound up and down. Okay, So the sound button is down there. You can take the sound up or down. If you had a really quiet clip versus a really loud clip, you can adjust them so they're the same, um, uh, same noise level. Okay. Um, there's several things you can do within this um, clip. You can also hit the settings button, which is in the bottom left, bottom right hand corner, and you can do a few things here. Okay? You can do things like turn the theme music on and off. So if I've got CNN iNews report turned on, uh, that theme turned on, I can turn the theme music on or off. Um, I can speed the changes up. I can fade it in and out. Uh, that type of stuff. Okay? If I turn the theme music on, you will see that a green box comes up below. Okay, With that green box, um, there will be theme music. So if I go over here and play, you'll hear the theme music, I think. No, it's probably just going to come from the iPad. Anyway. Yeah, it's just coming out the iPad. So, um, but you can, uh, if I, so there you couldn't hear the theme music, you actually heard them. But you can uh, take the sound all the way down on the video clip and uh, turn it up on the theme music. The way you do that is you would click on the video clip, make it yellow, maybe, turn the theme music down, and then turn this music, the green music, up. Okay? I'm going to turn the theme music off for now. And I'm also going to show you how to split a clip. Okay? Um, you can, uh, if you go to the video, um, you can do several things here. You can slow the speed down or speed it up. With video, you don't really need to do that. If you're putting pictures in, it, it helps better. You can also split a movie or freeze it for a certain amount of time. Okay? So if you wanted to split this into two different clips and put something in between it like a picture, you can do that. You just click on that and hit split. I'm not going to split this video because I don't know if that will affect the girls' video um, in their iMovie. Okay? Um, you can also put in titles and things like that. Okay? Um, if you click on the screen, uh, actually you have to be in the settings. Hmm. No, I take that back. Click on the video, 
click title, um, oops, title, and then click opening or closing. It'll give you a uh, box up there on the screen, okay? And then you can put in titles. Okay, you just tap on that button, it'll give you the text box, and then you can type in whatever title you want. Channel 1 News, um, Nazi News, whatever your title may be. Okay? Lastly, I do want you to put credits in. Okay? I want you to put credits in for your people. Now, you can do that at the beginning or at the end, but I want your actual name somewhere on it. Okay? In case I have to go back and look at them to grade them. Okay? The reason I want your actual names on there is because... Uh, I'm saying at the beginning or at the end, because I know many of you are changing your names within the newscast, and that's fine. And if you want to put those names on there, that's perfectly okay. But you need to um, put your names in it somewhere, either at the beginning or at the end. Most people do it at the end, um, and you kind of kind of um, play with that and figure out where you want it. Okay? There are lots of other tools on here that are cool. Those are the basic tools that you guys will need to be able to edit your video. If you want to um, add stuff in after you're done, go for it. The more stuff you put in, um, the cooler it'll be. Okay. So, um, but make sure that you get your video clips edited and in to the length they need to be, uh, the order they need to be. Um, put your credits in. Okay. Um, before you start um, putting in commercials or uh, adding in music or anything like that. Okay. Any questions? All right. We're good to go. You sure? Did you stop? Say bye from before I. Bye.